Round the corner we go. This is the uh, big capacity. There's actually two classes combined in one. What we call our seniors, which are our 10 to 14 years class. There's actually no group for these uh, seniors to ride on. And so they've actually been brought under the fold of uh, Mini Motocross. So they're older than Mini Kids, uh, but there is uh, but two of them, Aidan Shearley and Joshua Bathgate, on their 190cc machines, uh, respectively. But it's just that, uh, all right, there's our number two, our race leader, and getting us a night. Now, if you have a look at this, folks, if you were doubtful of the speed of what these bikes were capable of before, now match this with the helicopter. Parallel, side by side. In fact, he's going faster than the chopper is cruising through here at the moment. Brilliant to watch. Look at that. And he's even taking on the corners, up and over the jumps. Great skills. Now, don't say that ATV riding is easy. This is going to give us the opportunity to prove just how much work the pilot's got to do. You can see the marking of the track there. Just what the guys and girls from this bush club have done with their mini motocross effort here is extraordinary. We're going to ride in here on the pits at the moment, and uh, there we've got 55. In fact, uh, yes, well done. Nice to say hello to Olivia Stewart there from Railway. We're about to see that uh, curve. Here it is. It's called the whole shot. Watch for it to go, and hopefully to get a clear run on the corner. What have we got uh, out wide? Oh, a little bit of carnage. Oh, one to go down in the front as well. Costly mistake. One of our top riders. Your love is cornering. You watch that uh, Pelini behind him of the man from Manurewa on the, the uh, XP65. He will be quicker along the straight. You watch him gain up, but it's uh, Scott's cornering skills that give it to him, and I would suggest from that probably the potential to be... Uh, a great rider in years to come, and why not? Now, look at that. There's a 65. How much grounds it made up? It wasn't even in the photo shop before. It's now got right into this Teru television coverage, and uh, the Teru Heliworks uh, machine is uh, covering it so brilliantly, and again, giving us an idea of the true speed of these riders. Those... Uh, Peg Mark has gone past quicker than pickets on a fence, that's for sure. And here it is now. Watch that 65. Look at it. Right in the drive and behind. Beautiful to watch. Finally, television coverage that uh, does our sport justice to realise that these guys are liquid lightning flowing as perfect as ever. In fact, they are flowing faster than the water down that river for sure. Well, you watch what he does here. This is a sign of a good rider. So one is taken quite safely. There's the uh, yellow being waved. That's with interest to uh, just see the uh, the riders. Now we're going to go outside. Watch that again. Oh, beautiful. Tucks up inside. That's nice. So there's another one taken. No way is he going to bash bars with him. Doesn't have to. Now here we go, right around the outside. So it means going around the outside of a corner. Now watch what comes up. That was an easy victim. You watch what happens here. Look at that. One, no, two. Two of them on the jump at the same time. Brilliant. So there's that uh, back marker.